case briefs and so much more ls data's got what you're looking for in 2000 the united states court of appeals for the armed forces heard the case united states versus valigura which centered around the requirements for charging someone with conspiracy to be charged with conspiracy, it has been traditionally held that at least two people must be genuinely trying to accomplish the same criminal goal. Private Valagura was convicted of conspiracy to distribute marijuana, but this verdict was overturned on appeal. The court had to decide whether to apply the unilateral theory of conspiracy to military justice cases, which would only require one person to have the intent to commit the crime. The majority opinion sided with the traditional bilateral theory ruling that the undercover agent's lack of intent meant that no conspiracy had taken place, and therefore Private Valagura could not be found guilty. The court ultimately decided against using the unilateral theory of conspiracy in military drug conspiracy cases, upholding the lower court's decision to set aside the conspiracy conviction and maintain the attempted conspiracy conviction. The ruling stated that if Congress wished to change this approach, it would need to amend relevant statutes. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.